Hey guys, it's Moppet Edits here, and I'm back with another tutorial. And in this tutorial, I'm going to be teaching you how to make this Instagram style effect on any picture you want. It can be done for city landscapes, it can be done for portraits, anything you want, and it's really easy to do. Um, I decided to do this because some people don't actually have Instagram to be able to get these color corrections, and most people are on PC. So I thought I'll make a tutorial on it for the PC. So what you're going to need to do is open up your document you need and double click the back layer so uh, it unlocks it then click down here with the uh, sort of yin yang symbol click that and you need to click levels and you want to change your RGB to blue and then here you just mess about with the output levels but I've already got mine set to what I want which is 51 and that's that done then the next thing you're going to want to do is click that little symbol again and go to solid color and then we're going to go for a really soft peach color which is F6 DDAD and click OK and then change the blend mode to multiply and as you can see what it does is it just brings a really soft color over the top of it and it blends well with the blue and then all you're going to want to do now is add some curves and this sorts out all the uh, all the brightness and all the shadows so the first stop you want to put the output to 38 and input 0 and then the next one you're going to want to put to 75 input uh, output sorry and then input to be 70 and then the last stop that you need to put down needs to be 203 output and 167 input and there you have it that's the uh, look now if you want to you can fiddle about with the settings to sort out your picture but what I'm going to do is teach you how to make a vignette all you need to do is create a new layer above the one you're working on make sure you have black selected as your foreground color get your elliptical marquee tool click in the bottom uh, top left to the bottom right now create that shape and if you press control shift I it will invert your selection and then if you press alt backspace it will color that all in black and then press control D to deselect that and as you can see it's a uh, it's a bit too big so all you need to do is click filter blur Gaussian blur and you just put this up to as much as you want I'm going to go for about 65.5 and then press control T and transform it to whatever size you want so about there and there you go that's a simple vignette and you can put it to all your photos and obviously you can decrease and increase the opacity depending on what your personal preference is so if you like this tutorial please leave a like and a comment for what you want to have put up next week and yeah, thank you so much for watching and this is Mopped Edit signing out. Peace. Love is you.